what's up guys welcome back to my channel so I should have done this before when um, we finished playing but I want to give you guys my review on playing Cuphead <sighs> because we were just talking about it the other day and you guys absolutely loved 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 watching us play Cuphead because it was absolutely insane all right so First of all, I absolutely love the way that the game was made. It was like very nostalgic. It looked very cartoony the way that I um, grew up watching cartoons and, you know, the old school uh, cartoon kind of thing really, really, really uh, made me gravitate to the game. Um, but other than that, like I just enjoyed... I just enjoyed like the the graphics of it all I think they did an amazing job making this game um, and you guys know like I'm not like into the technicalities of you know um, games and, and who makes what but I'm learning but anyway these two gentlemen that they did this game that made this game did it uh, did such a good job that it pissed us off okay um, every level was different Every level was an experience in itself. Um, you know, we decided to play, you know, based on, you know, beating each boss. Um, sometimes we played longer than other times. But when I sit here and I tell you that it, if you're playing it with your significant other, if you survive playing Cuphead, you can survive anything. Okay. This has caused almost fights on live streams. <laughs> I mean, this game had us going absolutely nuts. If you guys want to go see, they are all up on Tyrone's channel and mine. Um, you'll see our crazy live streams. The bosses, like, we watched a few... Um, a few videos um, on the games and what and reviews and things like that and some some of them had you know like um the the bosses from like easiest to hardest we had a little bit of uh, different feelings on that like there was some bosses that some people thought were hard and we didn't think that they were that hard I feel like honestly it would have probably been easier to play the game separately um, because playing with a partner really does make it a little more challenging because you have to rely on each other, you have to wait for each other, um, you have to save each other, which was very frustrating to Tyrone because he definitely saved us both throughout almost the whole, well, the whole game. He definitely carried us. Um, but it was still enjoyable, you know, but it was stressful. Like, there was a few times where literally, like, we, I would feel so stressed out like you guys know the games that I have played so far, it was it's been Fortnite, um, it's been the Resident Evil games. Um I I started playing Ratchet and Clank and The Last of Us, but those games got erased, so I had to start them over. But none of the games that I have ever played that you guys have seen have made me feel so much rage like Cuphead did. It literally made me so mad. <laughs> That I would literally, like, you know, a lot of people um, carry a lot of stress on their back. I mean, I would have tension headaches sometimes because it was that stressful. And I literally, we would go to bed and I would literally, I would sit, I would lay there in bed. And I'm like, I am so glad we're not playing anymore. Like, there were so many times that I just wanted to just stop because it was just that crazy. But overall, overall, you know, it was definitely an amazing game. It was a game of um, timing. It had a lot to do with timing. You had to, you know, really make sure that you had the timing down to a lot of this game because... You know, to beat every boss, you have to dodge, you have to shoot, you have to, you know, uh, jump over, you have to, you know, duck under. There were so many different things going on. And some of the bosses, you know, when you would fight some of these bosses, it was a lot of stuff going on, a lot of things thrown at you. And, 
you know, you had to do so many things so fast um, on top of trying to save the other person if they get hit. So a lot of the, there was a lot of frustrating moments. And I know, I know Tyrone wanted to pull his hair out so bad so many times. Um, but overall, um, I rate, I really do rate the game. Um, I want to say 4.5 because that other 0.5 that I'm not giving it is the frustration that it cost me <laughs> and us. Um, but other than that, it was an amazing game. I would definitely want to play it again by myself. I don't think I'd do a live stream because you guys already saw it. Um, but I would love to see, you know, to, to kind of perfect it and go through it on, on my own and try to beat the bosses on my own because a lot of them were hard for me. Um, that I knew if I played by myself, it probably would have taken me a lot longer to play. But I really enjoyed the game. I really, really did. I know over time, um, they've kind of revamped and kind of switched a few things. Um, I, at first, thought that this was the first time this game came out, but the game was already out. Um, but they've kind of changed a few things, I believe. Not a lot, but, um, you know, I think that they did a great job with this, and, and I definitely give it a 4.5. So, if you guys haven't played Cuphead, please, by all means, go do it. And enjoy it, and let me know how you guys liked it. All right? Leave your comments down below. Let me know if you enjoyed this gaming review. Sorry I came to you so late. I didn't think about it because I started playing Outlast and I was busy playing Resident Evil 2. And between everything else, I'm like, wait a minute, I never did a gaming review for Cuphead. So there you guys have it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you haven't done so, please subscribe to my channel. Hit like, share, and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you guys can get notified whenever I pop up on your feed. I'll see you guys later. Toodles!